Hello everyone, it is Bram Badaham and welcome back to Let's Play Dragon Age 2, episode 43. In the last episode, we hunted one of the three apostate mages that Meredith asked us to hunt down. And we just talked to Nyssa back in the alienage and she told us that um, her, I don't know if it's husband? But it's an elf called Yuan, and he uh, he hid somewhere. We now have to find him. So we should go to the or I I think she said that he would come to the alienage by nightfall. If I remember correctly. So let's see if that is true. Whether we can track him. And most probably hunt him down. So, nightfall. Low town. Yeah, one thing that I wonder, I'm not really sure on how that works, is that. Hey, Samson again. Things are Templar. heating up. It's a good time. But what I don't really get is that. Meredith ordered us to hunt down these apostate mages. But there's nothing that we can do. And Orsino is the mage who wants to oppose Meredith and start, uh, wants to start a riot or something. But now we are a mage as our Neria character. We are good friends with Meryl. Oh my gosh. We're good friends with Meryl here, and she is a mage, obviously, so I don't really get why we should have to work with Meredith, even though she is a, uh, yeah, what, what would you call her? She's just really violent and so completely anti-mage. But we have to do work for her, and... I really would like to work for Orsino, but he's such a an ass face, I guess. How would you call him? Holy oh, crap. Huan. It's him. Oh blood magic. Oh man. She was so beautiful. <sighs> Not again. Someday I'd like to go one week without meeting an insane mage. Just one week. I'm visionary. I've seen our destiny. I know what fate holds for the elves. The humans keep us down because they're afraid of the magic within us. Look at the magic Lisa held inside her. She was just afraid to lose it. Oh shit. Now there's no denying that blood magic sure is powerful. Let's start off with a tempest. And then we will cast a sleep on these guys. Um, you, good man, should do a disorient on him. And then we will... That works. No! Never mind, it didn't work. Okay. We'll do it like this then. Crap! 
Oh. Codex! Haha. You can pause the video here and read it. I thought he turned into that statue there for a sec. You on. Sit down, please. Have a misdirection, Hex. And I totally don't pay attention to my health. Oh my god. Now, Evelyn, you should come up with something clever. Okay, that, that should work, probably. Why are the shades fighting each other there? Look at that! They're fighting each other! A longbow that we don't need. I'm too good looking to die this young. <laughs> so true. So true. Is it the first time that our main character died? Hmm. Maybe. Now you won. You won as the boots of the champion. Awesome. And we have a fell poison. Now can we equip that already? That champion's armor set. <laughs> Look at that. It surely is better than the set we have right now. That is a shame though that... I think... Yeah, we can only get that whole armor of the Overseer set. Uh, in act number three that we are in right now. We'll actually go and do that in a bit. But now we have already two or three parts. Uh, parts of the champion armor set. Let's see. We have the gloves, the, the gloves, and the boots. And they are way better than the armor seer. Uh, armor of the overseer. So that's a weird thing. But oh well. Gamlin man. So you've done well for yourself. I had my doubts the first time I saw you, but I guess there was something to that hawk fellow Leandra ran off with after all. You certainly produced an amazing daughter. Your mother would be proud. I do not trust you. What are you angling for? I'm feeling sentimental. With your brother and the Templars, you're the only real family I've got. For a long time, I thought the Amel line in Kirkwall would end at me. I'm glad you pulled it out of the grave. Oh. Well, that surely was spectacular. What's this? Gamla and I found the gem of Geroshek. He wanted to come to Darktown alone. Leave that alone. There are things in my life. Oh? Oh, oh, okay. But don't actually... That note mentioned the gem of Karoshek. What's that? It's nothing. Never mind. You're hiding something. Spit it out. It's nothing. Just like last time when I found Grandfather's will. Ah, don't be stupid. I lost everything chasing that gem. Our fortune, our home, even Mara. Mara? Who's Mara? She's... None of your concern. That's who she is. Why don't you head back to your fancy house in Hightown and stay out of my damn business? Man, I just wanna 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 stab him. Jeez. Updated quest. Go to Darktown and confront the person asking after Gamlin. Okay, we will. Can we still have a look at this desk? Nope. Our papers are gone. See, is there anything else in this house? A book? No. Alrighty. Probably not. Oh, actually, the founding of the Chantry. Awesome, you can pause the video here and read it. That's really cool. Okay, let's go. What's this even about? Mm. 
Meryl, please. Cast your Tempest already. This is the maker. Whoa! He just fell apart. Oh, I'm so looking forward to that upgrade that we'll get for that. Don't tell me there's more. Thank you. Now, leave the area. High town at night for the last on the loose thing. Gamlin's treasure in Darktown, just like Justice's or the Justice Quest for Anders. We can go to the Deep Roads for Nathaniel. This is awesome. I haven't done this before because I didn't do the uh, Awakening DLC before, I guess, with importing that into this game. One thing, though, that I want to do, and maybe if it turns out to be not helpful at all I will uh, speed this part up but there is one thing that I just talked about the uh, over what about the overseer armor set that usually is meant for act 2 and because the champion armor set is way better oh the crap because the champion armor set is way better uh, you're really only meant to use it through Act 2. But you can only get the robes of that set, so get the armor bonus for having all the parts of the set in Act 3. And it happens to know, or it happens to be that I do know where to find those robes. Sylvan would ring. Memento of the Dalish. But that's a little gift for Meryl later on. So we're somewhere up the Sundermount Passage. And what's this scroll? You can pause the video here and read it. Is that a keeper? No, just a hunter. And, oh, now that I think of it, Master Island Shop should have updated or uh, upgraded as well. Most probably. Let's have a look. The True Bow. Wow. That sure looks good. Health potions. Injury kits. Rune of Nature warding. Why not? Dalish crafting is second to none, I assure you. Okay, so that, that wasn't really uh, awesome. But... Let's see. Let's go through here. I'll speed this up. his own codex. You can pause the video here and read it. So that was a kind of funny fight. Huh? Oh, one more. Oh, um. That Tempest worked out well. Now we have to go through here. And we'll probably encounter some spiders again.
Well, let's see if it's correct what I thought it would be if we raid these graves. There it is, robes of the overseer. And nothing even happens after we take it. Ooh. Man, there are so many belts and they are so similar. Oh, we can go back here. Mithal, all mothers, protector of the people, watch over us. For the path we tread is perilous. Save us from the darkness, as you did before, and we will sing your name to the heavens. Sorry. I didn't mean to hold us. You just... It's never wise to ignore Mithal. Mithal? Who or what is Mithal? She's the protector. The mother of the creators. The one who put the moon in the sky. Wisest of all the gods. When Elganarn defeated his father, the sun, the earth was plunged into darkness. Everything was about to perish. Mithal appeared then, calmed Elganarn, and restored the sun to the heavens. The people always look to her for help. Everything will be fine. There's no need to worry. Nothing will happen. I hope not. But the people never neglect Mithal's shrines. She... It's dangerous. They say if Mithal smiles on you, then you need fear nothing at all. But those who anger her, they're struck from the earth, as if they never lived at all. Okay, interesting. Now then, let's have a close look at our stats here. 361, 60 damage. We can wear the Overseer armor now. And we should have... 395, yeah. We uh, do get a good bonus for this. Okay, I'll quickly go here, down here. See if there's anything. If not, I'll go back quickly. And we are all the way back in the Dalish camp. Now let's see if Keeper Marathari has something to ask or to tell. No. Because Meryl in... Holy crap! Ogre? What? Really? Darkspawn? Oh, that's most, most interesting. Where's your confusion then, Barry? Really did nothing? <laughs> Sit down. Hmm. Dark spawn, eh? Wait. Recently opened passage? Where does this lead to? I didn't even have a clue. Have you been here before? Oh. Uh, I think we have. Okay. Leave the area and let's go into the deep roads. Let's go and find Nathaniel. Honestly, I have no clue how the Deep Roads look in Dragon Age 2. Oh, so they do look like this. 
Okay. Actually, wait, I do have a clue because <laughs> we went there with Bartrand, of course. I totally forgot. I have it imprinted in my brain that the game only takes place in purple. Investment of sacrifice. Hmm. Nathaniel. He's already here. Look at him. We found him already. Awesome. Nathaniel, buddy. How are you doing? Oh, there's more. And... Bang. Hey, Nathaniel. He took an arrow to the face. Nathaniel, how? You're the champion of Kirkwall, aren't you? Your handiwork here is much appreciated. How did you... Delilah. She figured things out then. Good. I should have spoken to you. The deep roads have proved to be quite dangerous. Your insight could have saved lives. Delilah will be relieved. We should bring your sister the good news. I cannot leave now. When we were attacked, I was separated from the rest of my expedition. Some of them may yet live. We must go deeper into the tunnels to rescue them. What are you looking for? Or who are you looking for? Who else could be alive? Some wardens survived the initial ambush. I think the dwarf we brought from Vigil's Keep survived. But who still lives? Only the Maker knows. Wow, so Vigil's Keep. That's from uh, Awakening. And I try to remember the dwarf. Would it be Dwork in the mat with his explosives? That would be awesome. Let's go find them. We have survivors to find. Let's go. Protecting the foolish from themselves. Hey, hey, hey. We should move. Stay alert for Darkspawn. There are my old buddies, Aveline. Stay alert. They could come at any moment. Oh, what? Ooh, a Tempest again. Lol. Oh, 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 okay. Awesome. No, I saw something here. A pile of bones. Opal fragment. A hurlock. Let's see. There's an indicator there. I wonder who that is. First check here. Don't miss anything. It's Glavonok. And I see an ogre there in the back. Is this a dwarf? Master Howe, you live. Tamarin, good man. Are there any other survivors? Hopefully, up ahead. Well met are strangers in the belly of the earth. I hope Sir Fenley won't mind, but I set up the explosives here and there. Figured I'd blow up as many of the spawn as I could before I embraced the stone. Explosive? Sounds like fun. Corridors lined with explosives and darkspawn galore. It's not even my birthday. Temerin, the way behind us is clear. Send word to the wardens in case we don't make it. Aye, I've set explosives all along the tunnels. Blow up as many of the sodding spawn as you can. Luck to you both. Now, let's do some arcade game of blowing up darkspawn then. Aha. Stay alert. They could come at any moment. But how do we do this? Oh, here we go. Oh, oh yes, then. Best of the maker. Oh, 
Oh, hurl. Crap. Oh. Where did that zone land? I didn't even see. Ogre. Okay. Well, let's see if we can find one more survivor in this episode, shall we? Ooh, more levers. I fear we have come all this way for nothing. Oh. But my fallen comrades will be avenged. The Darkspawn are here. Well, that's weird. That's not the bow that we had in Awakening. He had his grandfather's bow. Oh, let's pull the lever. I don't know what happens. Let's just blow up something. Oh, crap. Sorry, Nathaniel. Nope. More coming. Oh my god. Awesome. For the first time since I've been down here, I don't sense a single darkspawn. We've won. The route to the surface should be safe now. Because of you, I will see my sister and nephew again. Please, take this with my blessing. I apologize I couldn't answer all your questions. You may have them yet in the fullness of time. Stay safe, Nathaniel. You as well. Okay then. The bringer of silence. That's probably a bow. Right. Oh, it's a longsword actually. Oh! Kind of decent longsword. Look at that. Oh, but not better than the one we have. Sadly, now let's have a look. Let's loot some more while we're at it. Ward wall, 190. Oh! Aha! Awesome. I got your back. Now what's this? These are the things I just absolutely love about the game. The fact that you get rewarded for, for things like this. Now let's see. Barrack. Yeah, that was your final upgrade. Awesome. Now, I think I'll cut off the video here in the middle of the deep roads. Thank you so much for watching this episode. Where we... Um, met the Yuan uh, what's he called? Apostate, the Blood Mage we killed him and then we came here in the Deep Roads to help and find Nathaniel and we went up Sundermount as well where we completed our Overseer armor set so a very productive episode all in all thank you so much for watching I hope you enjoyed and stay tuned for the next episode to be uploaded soon Thanks for watching, guys.